Lori Shapiro, and I am Toad Lily. I'm here at Jane's Vanity today doing an exclusive debut of my sophomore collection called Femme Fatales, and Jane's has been a big supporter of mine since the beginning. They're based in Portland, and I've had a chance to share these new pieces with their customers and get some really great feedback. They are hot off the press. They just came off my sewing machine last week and um, haven't even been released to the public, but I will share with you. So I have... Um, Four different styles, all named after femme fatales. Um, totally is very much about um, evoking a playful spirit. I joke about how Tolily is really all about the big ta-da. So I'm a big fan of getting dressed up special for the evening. This is a um, silk balconette bra. Tolily is a bit different in the fact that all of the bras are handmade at the moment by myself, but also they are silk lined. Um, they're silk lined, the lace is applique by hand, they are edge stitched, they have padded silk channeling um, in the cups here, so they feel absolutely delightful on. Uh, most of my customers are women with um, fuller busts, so totally now offers up to a size double D, which is very exciting. Here is the matching panty. This set is actually called um, Vixen. And so this is a high waist panty with a um, little bit of a lace cut out here in the front. You'll see that there is a little bit of ruching there on the bottom for a little extra definition and sex appeal. This panty is fun because it has four detachable garters. I am a huge fan of bows, as you can tell. They're on almost everything. Um, these are super cute because you got the bow right here on the cheeky bottom, so they're so flirty. Um, this set is derivative of Vixen, but slightly naughtier. This femme fatale is called Vamp. And so this is a quarter cup. You take it off the hanger here, and you can have a better look. So totally offers something unique where it's a quarter cup shelf bra, but in um, a bit more glamorous, uh, accessible sort of way. So for women who want something bold, but uh, are a little shy to kind of let it all hang out. This bra is so fun because the lace strategically covers the nipple, so we have just a playful hint of what you might get a peek of. Again, um, all of the bras are lined, and the quarter cups have this wonderful um, sort of little sling piece here on the side that help cup the breast um, and give really wonderful shape. So that is Vam. And that comes in this fantastic teal color, which has been the hit of the day today at the trunk show. It comes with a matching little bikini. Uh, all of Toad Lily's um, panties are um, fully finished inside. I have no surged edges. Uh, the, the sides are French seamed. The gussets are silk. The lace is hand appliqued, and this panty actually has a darling little um, keyhole there, just for that little bit of cheeky playfulness. It looks super duper cute with this high waist garter belt, again made of the stretch silk charmeuse, which really just hugs the figure uh, so flatteringly. This garter belt has a center panel that also has a layer of power mesh, and we have some boning in the seaming, so it really helps accentuate the waist, and um, especially define a waist for a woman who maybe doesn't have one, or definitely show off a waist for women who do. And here is a version of a panty that was my huge seller last season called, um, at the time it was called The Girls of Vamp, which has inspired this collection to be called Vamp. So it's a high waist, with um, a large kind of peephole back that will open up um, and show a cute little bit of um, oh. sexy butt cleavage there. And you can get a nice close-up shot of that lotus lotus blossom lace them, which is so pretty. And so this flirty set is all about the ruffles, of which I'm a huge fan. So um, this set is called Tease. 
so it's a little bit of playful sexuality perhaps not as overt as some of the other sets uh, this panty has a cheeky little cut in the back um, which helps set off the ruffles nicely um, I actually hand dye all of the elastic and these jewel tones so we have this beautiful violet elastic the ruffles on here have this really fine rolled hem which is delightful and so feminine its matching bra is a balconette again all of the um, elastic and hardware have all been hand dyed to match the violet And you'll see they're just as pretty on the inside as they are on the outside because I'm a huge believer that when you adorn yourself, you should feel fantastic when you put them on, even if you are the only one that, that gets to see that. Um, this has these little self um, silk straps with the little flirty chiffon ruffle. This is super cute if you're wearing a tank and want a little bit of ruffle on the edge there. And this is my new favorite sort of showcase piece. This is a nod back to 1940s style, of which Tolili is a huge fan. This is a this is a proper bed jacket. So it would be sort of a little shorty robe. Um, it's got a fantastic trapeze shape with 15 yards of hand rolled chiffon trim. The trim is actually then bound in charmeuse, so everything is fully finished. Um, it has these really sweet little sleeves that come up on the side with little bows that kind of sit on the inside of your arms. So it's very dainty and it can be worn as a blouse out, um, you know, in the real world or it can be worn over nothing in the boudoir, which is equally cute. <laughs> and lastly, we have minx, which is... Um, which is quite fun. So I always say that this quarter cup is all in the unwrapping. So this, um, unfortunately, our mannequin here is a little on the smaller side, but they are silk lined cups. You'll see that these quarter cups actually have darts on either side to cup the breast. They have that little extra side panel of fabric to also cup the breast. Um, again, they're fully lined. These extra panels here, these ties, are made of silk chiffon, and they are all about being untied. So this is great fun for doing your own little private striptease. Or as Jane showed a client, you could actually untie the bows and tie them up over the neck halter style, which was drop dead sexy. I hadn't thought of that, so thanks, Jane. And um, it has little matching pan bikini panties. The, the bows on these panties are actually permanently affixed. Mm -hmm. um, they don't untie like the bra, but they have these sweet little chiffon, silk chiffon stretch cutouts, again, that are French seamed and edge stitched with a darling little cheeky backed bikini. Again, stretch silk chiffon, so they feel wonderful against the skin and that extra bit of elastic um, ruching up the bottom really helps define the bottom. And so that is Toad Lily's Femme Fatale's Autumn Winter 2011-2012 collection.